Lepke Butchalter, born Louis Butchalter, was a notorious American gangster and hitman who rose to power during the Prohibition era in the early 20th century. He was the head of the infamous hit squad, Murder Incorporated, which was responsible for numerous assassinations and organized crime activities. Butchalter was born on February 12, 1897, in New York City. He grew up in poverty in the Lower East Side and dropped out of school at an early age. His parents were immigrants from Romania, and his father was a pushcart peddler. Butchalter had a troubled childhood and was known for getting into fights. Butchalter's criminal career began as a teenager when he became involved in petty theft and extortion. He eventually became associated with the infamous gangster, Jacob Gura Shapiro, and worked his way up the ranks of the criminal underworld. Butchalter became the head of Murder Incorporated, a group of hitmen who carried out assassinations for the National Crime Syndicate. He was known for his ruthlessness and his ability to eliminate his enemies without leaving a trace. Butchalter became one of the most powerful and feared gangsters in America during the 1930s. Butchalter was married twice and had two children. He was known for being a private person and kept his personal life separate from his criminal activities. Butchalter's most significant achievement was his leadership of Murder Incorporated, which was responsible for hundreds of murders during the Prohibition era. He was also involved in illegal gambling and labor racketeering. Butchalter faced numerous challenges and obstacles throughout his criminal career, including several arrests and trials. He was eventually convicted of murder and executed in the electric chair in 1944. Butchalter's legacy is one of violence and corruption. He was a prominent figure in the organized crime world, and his leadership of Murder Incorporated cemented his place in American history as a ruthless and dangerous gangster. Lepke Butchalter's life and legacy serve as a cautionary tale about the dangers of organized crime and the importance of law and order in society. His brutal methods and disregard for human life were applied on American history, and his execution served as a warning to others who would follow in his footsteps.